Hi everyone! Today I'm gonna do a little something special for this Loon Reading Wednesday. A good friend of mine came with a fun idea and I decided to participate in it. It's called Pick a Deck Reading. So basically how it works is that you choose one of the three cards, but me I'm gonna do it with runes. So you pick one of them and then I'm gonna pick three of each and I'm gonna tell you what they mean. So, and you're gonna see if it resonates with you or not. And it's just for fun. So it's a little fun. So I'm gonna do it for today till the 29th of September. So we have the three sets of runes are the witch runes, the Furtak runes, and these are special. They're called Galdrasta Fears. So, let's begin. So here we go, let's begin. The first rune is the Crossroads runes. So as the runes said, you may feel that you are in the crossroad at this time of your life so you need to think about it and try to find the best way for you and yes there can be more than one way but like i said try to take the best one for you the best choice for you and your family now second rune is the stars oops sorry so um this one it rules your eyes gold and your dreams um it can indicate fame or prosperity and wealth so that's a good rune to have so maybe at your job you will be successful or something good. Maybe a promotion can happen or you're going to have some wealth, wealth. Sorry. Here, third rune, we have the sight. So this rune is governed by Pluto, which is the hidden planet. Um, and if someone... If someone may not be truthful or um, try to hide things from you, well, then it will be uncovered. Um, you may be finding some mystery or some ancestor mystery too. But yeah, it's a good room to find some hidden truth. The fruit that is now. Okay, here we have Manas reversed. So you may be in a period of depression. Um, be careful if you think about uh, taking some uh, serious decision. I think now it's not the good time for that. You better wait a little bit for that. Um, oh yeah, be careful on who you trust too, because some may be there to help you and other may, be, may not be there for that. So be very careful of that. Rule number two is Rule number two is a was. So, it represents the yew tree. Um, as they say, the yew may bend, but it never break. So, you are on the right course, and you have the strength and ability to meet your goals. Congratulations. Rule number three is...
It's no days. This rune is no days. So uh, you may have unmet mates or friction in relationship. Um, you, sorry, you may be in a time um, to be very careful in whatever endeavor you take on. Um, or you might simply be uh, about to learn some of life's hard lessons and come out of the other side a strong being. So this is your rune reading for this week. So now time for the Gyadra Staphirs or by moon depending. So here we go. Okay, first one is called I hope I pronounce it right. Fadi Hlip. It means father's protection. Now this is if you need some protection from a father or a father figure so if you need help don't be afraid to ask for it or simply means that your father will protect you second one is this one is for divination magic so I think it would be a good time to work on some divination techniques if you need to get better in one divination or maybe try a new one if you want. Number three is divine interaction. Now I feel this one that it means that some of your deities or maybe new ones will try to reach from you. So let your heart and your ears open and don't be afraid to, to listen to what they have to say or ask for some guidance and they will help you to make better choice. So thank you. I hope you enjoyed this new way of doing this and if you want to try it you can you can um you can join us on which fall fun